What's up everyone, Cosmo in the house and today we're back in Trailmakers trying to replicate an amazing feat of aerospace engineering history. Does that even make sense? An amazing feat of? An amazing feat in? I don't know man, I'm too Ukrainian for this. But as you guys can tell by the title and the thumbnail, I am talking about the Wright Flyer, the Kitty Hawk, Flyer 1, whatever you want to call it. It's, uh, it's gonna happen, guys. Now, when sales first came out, I was like, hmm, those look awfully close to what the panels of the Wright Flyer look like. Now, I honestly don't know how much lift we're going to be able to generate with the sails without any wind, but I still want to try to build this Wright Flyer out of, uh, well, basically sails, and then we'll see how that works if we need to make adjustments if we need to add a bit of maybe like airfoils to it we can always do that but i think uh trying to build this thing is purely out of sales will be really really cool so let's get to it i'm going to start a time lapse guys i may stop it once in a while just to kind of go over what i'm doing but uh for now let's just let's just build the frame i'm having a little bit of a hard time deciphering what the frame on this thing actually looked like so it might be a little bit inaccurate but that's okay Well, this is kind of silly. The small sail is actually odd length, or I guess width, whichever way you want to look at it. And then the big sail is even width. So it's like, what the heck? I can't even line them up. Can't even line them up, man. Like, I don't really want to use airfoils yet, you know? I want this to be sail only, and it's being very difficult to do that. So even though on the original right flyer, the pilot actually lays kind of offset to the side, uh, we're not gonna have that because we're not gonna really gonna have the traditional controls with all the levers and the pulleys and stuff. And we're also not going to have an engine on the side here because, well, we're probably just going to have two propellered engines that don't have any external components otherwise. So I just figured I'd go with a go-kart seat right down the middle and that looks pretty good. Now for the front here, guys, I just don't know what to do. There really isn't a sail that fits there well and I don't want to use airfoils because I don't want to create a bunch of lift up front. So for now, we're just gonna do this and hope that it works well. If not, we'll have to switch it up. But in any case, guys, I'm gonna keep going. I'm getting really excited about this. This is turning less into a replica and more into just like a proof of concept type deal. Uh, I just don't have the uh, I just don't have the tools to make it exactly like it's supposed to be, but that's okay. The end result should be all the same in terms of function if this actually does end up working. <laughs> big if, big if. I was hoping to use the helicopter blades, but I feel like they're just a little bit too big for my creation. <laughs> Need them to be a little bit smaller. They're just way too big. Alrighty, looks nothing like the right flyer. <laughs> Let's build the tail section, guys. gotta have the sails in the back. We just have to have the sails in the back, otherwise this won't look the same. This won't look the same.
there we go there's our tail well i think now i can try building the actual uh, sail wings Ooh, i'm noticing a little thing that i need to change here now you guys might be wondering why i have skis down here well the original right flyer actually launched from like a track style system so i'm going to try and replicate that track system here as well and hopefully we can take off from the ground i i don't know man i don't know we'll see <laughs> I'm also worried that these two props won't be enough, but you know, we'll just have to figure that one out the hard way. We'd be curious to know like how many pounds of thrust these guys put out and then from there, you know, be able to calculate if I'm going to actually be able to push my creation or not, let alone lift off. Okay guys, so now comes the fun part of making the wings. Now the original Wright Flyer wings, in order to control the roll, what they did was they had this really nifty system of pulleys that would actually flex the wings in desired directions and make the plane steer. This was all done by the pilot shifting their weight around, which is really cool. It's a really neat system. If I can find a, a good like graphic of it, I'll throw it in here. But we're obviously not going to do that, guys. We're just going to use some hinges here. This is a modernized right flyer you know this is what the Wright brothers would have built if you dumped them into the trail makers world so <laughs> uh, just work with me here guys just work with me here i know it doesn't look exactly like the right flyer but we're trying and obviously sails aren't airfoils they have no curvature none of that so this is going to be interesting Oh my goodness, look at all these sails, guys. <laughs> this might be a little too much. I gotta check the proportions here. Not too bad. Not too bad. Not too far off, I'd say. I'm so nervous to try this. You guys don't even know. I'm so nervous to try this. Kind of looks like we're flexing our airfoil, you know? <laughs> we got yaw. Perfect. Can we just try taking off like this? This is not gonna work, is it? Oh no. <laughs> Wait, what? Huh, that actually wasn't horrible, guys. Up, up, oh no. <laughs> uh, it sounds about right. <laughs> okay, maybe let's go this way. Up, up, uh, oh no. <laughs> it like, it wants to go up, but only after a bit of flying, you know, it's really weird. I thought it was about my takeoff velocity, but it really isn't. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. <laughs> yes, go. Go. No. <laughs> Uh, my balance might be a little bit off as well. That's that that could be a thing. You know what? I'm gonna try airfoils up front, guys. I'm just gonna try airfoils up front, see how that works. And I'm also going to build the track that this thing is supposed to, I guess, take off of, which I think will be kind of fun. Alrighty, let's give that a go. It might lift up too much in the front now, but there's only one way to find out. Huh, it's actually not. Weird. This is a really bad takeoff place for this thing. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> I wonder what happens if we add more thrust to it. I know it looks weird, but just for the sake of experimenting. Up. 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 It's weird. It like falls, but then as soon as it catches air on the sails, it uh, it's all good again. Oh, better, better. Oh, we're definitely too much lift up front. Way too much lift up front. I wonder if I could add some weight there. I am going to refine this afterwards, but I just want to see what it is that's causing this thing to behave the way that it does. Oh, a little too much weight up front now, but let's see how that goes. I think we have a little too much weight up front now, guys. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, the tail got nicked. Let's decrease that weight. I think I went a little bit too aggro. Let's go with 230s. Come on. Lift off. Lift off. Oh. Ha. Huh. Ha. Huh. We're flying. We're actually flying, guys. This is amazing. 
and, and we can turn. What? <laughs> okay, now can I do it with only two props is the question. Wow, this is so cool, man. <laughs> I'm geeking out hard right now. I love when creations work out. It just makes me so happy. I like going to videos sometimes thinking like, man, like there is a chance this won't work. And then what do I do? Do I just upload the video anyway and show people the failure? I hate doing that. I like delivering results to you guys. But at the same time, somebody in my Discord server mentioned that this is a good way for the community to give you feedback and, you know, kind of like get the community to help build the thing. And I think that's cool, but I also feel the pressure on me to do it myself because, you know, I'm the content creator. I'm supposed to know what the heck I'm doing, right? <laughs> but anyway, guys, uh, this is this is awesome. Let's try it with only one set of engines. I'm gonna save this because I haven't in a while. Why are we already moving? I'm not gonna ask too many questions. Let's see if we can take off with just two and fly around with just two. It's having a hard time lifting off the ground, but... I mean, once it's all, oh, 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 come on, up, 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 what do we do? Ah, that's a tough one. I don't necessarily want to go more than two props, you know, but I know these are too weak. I just know they're too weak. We could do like a back-to-back style, actually, like this, and then it kind of looks like one propeller still, ish, you know, not really ish not exactly the most realistic mounting for my uh <laughs> my engines here but what can you do what can you do when you live in a shoe there i mean it's slightly less embarrassing <laughs> that should work i mean that's the same amount of engines that we had before when it worked so let's let's try it oh apparently there's already wind from where that makes no sense level out level out can we lift up with two engines it's having a tough time because my tail is kind of long and it's hitting the ground. But man, once we're up in the air, look at this. Look at this. I love it. Absolutely love it. <laughs> this is wicked. This is sustained fly, guys. This right now is me fully hands off. Yes, it is pitching down, but we can always adjust that. This is so cool, man. I did not think this would work. Okay, well, let me quickly build a track for it, guys, because that's... That's kind of part of it. So I really want to build a track that it takes off of and then we can... Oh man, look at this. Look at that turn. It's just so darn smooth. What? I, oh, I love this. This makes me so happy. Let's see if we can land this thing. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. <laughs> we really need the power. Like, we really need the power. Our gliding ability is a little bit meh. <laughs> okay, well, we landed. We're alive. Life is good. Let's build this, uh, let's build this track. Now, the track that they took off of actually is more like a rail, but I'm basically going to reverse that, and uh, the rail is going to be my skis, and then I'm going to have a groove, which is in this, uh, I guess, track system. Now, apparently, the track is like 60 feet long. I don't know how big that is in Trail Makers, but I mean, I think I need way more than that. <laughs> I wonder if this will work, or if it'll just get snacked up, you know? Oh, no! <laughs> we just... We just wrecked everything, man. We wrecked everything. This is horrible. The track is not working out, guys. The track is not working out. <laughs> yeah, there's just too many collisions, guys. Way too many collisions going on, unfortunately. Don't think I'll be able to do that. The only way I can really think of doing now... I was thinking like a piston launch, you know? Like a piston launch, but I don't think that... I mean, that wouldn't be historically accurate either, you know? I could stack up a bunch of pistons, have them contract, release at the right time, kind of like slingshot me. But I don't think, you know, I don't think I want to do that because that's just not how, how it was done. So, you know what, guys? Let's get rid of the track. Let's paint this thing up. I am pretty happy with it as is. I... In fact, I'm really happy with it as is. If the track system is the only thing I can't build in this episode, I am perfectly okay with that. <laughs> Alrighty, guys, here we go. All painted up. I'm super excited about this. My head is sticking out of the sail, but that's okay because when the sail is expanded, uh, it fits nicely underneath. So uh, let's just let's just take it for one more flight here because I just I love this thing, and uh, we'll call it a video. Let's go. Come on. Oh boy. Oh boy, we needed more take <laughs> This is... I swear, I swear it still works, guys. So let's just go in this direction, okay? Okay. <laughs> Need a little more speed. Perfect. There we go. Look at that. Oh, I absolutely love this. Makes me so happy that it worked, guys. And see? 
See, head fits perfectly now. <laughs> oh man. Well guys, I mean, what can I say? This is a success in my books. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Uh, let me know how you would have made it better or how you would have done something differently. Always curious to hear your guys' ideas. If you did like the video, definitely click the like button down below. Helps the video be seen by other people. The algorithm does its magic. And if you guys aren't subscribed yet, subscribe for more awesome trailer makers content and I will see you in the next one. Oh man, this is this is so cool. This is so cool. Uh, it flies so well. It it just it flies so so well. Love it. Love it. See you guys.